Hello, Advanced Word Weekly Revision Exercises continue in Section 5 and this one concerns itself with using calculations in Word. So it's question 11 and it's asking us to use a calculation, give the total for the fourth quarter only, make sure that the number format includes two decimal places and then there's a second part to the question asking us to change the oranges in the fourth quarter from 102 to 1 Two zero, and then update the calculation field. If you need any further help with this, please refer to the CIA Advance Manual, um, and that should give you some help. So let's do this. So still using the table document. If you haven't uh, got it open, please double click and open it from the weekly revision work files. It's the question is asked us to total up the fourth quarter only. So we're going to use this cell here and we're going to total these figures. We're already on the layout tab, but this is where you will find the formula that you can use in Word. A simple formula, it doesn't do anything as well as Excel, but it works in here for, for sort of bits and bobs. So here we go. Click on the formula and then this feature will bring up the um, sum if you want to sum and it'll do above, below, left or right. There is no need to, to change this, that's what it will do. If you want to use a different type of function then there are some more here. If I scroll down you can see that they're available and we're going to stick to what we're using today, sum. If we have to do the number format and it has asked us to use um, two decimal places so if we drop the number format down and we have some um, choices here. So the first one um, we will use the hash um, version because hashes allow people to input um, data and that's what we want. The zero is um, for a whole number and then the hashes with the 0, 0.00 is for decimal places. So that's one we want to use so that we have two decimal places. So then if we OK, you can see now that it's totaled up the fourth quarter column of data. If we select it you can see that it's a field so by, because it turns grey with one click. So then the second part of the question is asked is to change the figure here to 120 rather than 102. Nothing happened to the formula that we put in but if we right click it it is a field therefore we can update a field or edit a field. So in this case we're going to update it select that and you can see that the change in the figure has now been incorporated into the sum into the total and that's uh, calculations been used and updated so I'm going to move on to the the next question question 12 if you want to come along with me